What's up guys, Carrington here, and today I'm coming back with another video. I'm in collaboration with Sally Beauty. So if you guys saw my makeup tutorial on the sweet and hot red and pink look, today is going to be another version of that, but now we're going to be doing nail art. So I'm going to be doing a marble water drip DIY type of thing. I've never done this before and honestly I spent half of today just watching tutorials just trying to master it. My little sister says she's tried it before but she said that it didn't really work out so well so hopefully I can do this. I have all of my nail polishes right here. I have my pink and red. This is the Finger Paints Nail Color. This is in the shade Wear Art My Love. <laughs> and it's just a really pretty shimmery pink color. And the red nail polish is in the shade Malefio Red. So as a base color for the nails, I'm gonna be doing all of them marble, which I feel like is really bold because I looked at a bunch of tutorials and some people were just doing the ring finger or maybe like two fingers, but I'm gonna be doing all 10 fingerunes, and it's gonna be interesting, and hopefully it doesn't turn out like a mess. So I'm gonna use white as the base color. This is OPI, this is in the shade Funny Bunny. I already filed my nails and buffed them. I wanna show you guys what you guys will need, the nail polish that you want to create the marble look with, which I chose red pink. And you're also gonna need a base coat, and a top coat. And this is a dry fast top coat and this is a crystal clear base coat. You're going to need a bowl or a plastic bin or anything like that. I'm just gonna use a red plastic bowl to put the water in. It works best to use filtered water. I don't think I would be able to literally do this look if I did not have this. This is the Mess No More Liquid Tape for Nails and Peel Off Base Coat. You put it around your fingers and then you go in with the marble and then when you take it out, all you have to do is peel off the pink latex and it leaves you with like perfect nails, no mess. But just in case we do have a little bit of a mess, I got some pure acetone and last you're going to need toothpicks. This is to make the design in the paint once you've already put your drops in. So you can make a pretty swirly design. All right, so let's just get right into it. Okay, so first off, I'm gonna start by putting on my base coat and then painting my nails white as a base color. So now that my base coat is dry, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the white nail polish. Okay guys, so my nails are officially white. Now we're going to move on to the fun part. I didn't videotape painting my nails white just because it was kind of just a long process. I have my mess no more, I have my nail polish and my bowl. So now I'm going to take my bottled water and just pour. I'm gonna put about that much to where it's almost full. We're gonna go ahead and put this around our finger. Okay, so now I have the pink mess no more on my finger. I think I did this right, but yeah. Whoa, yes, that was pretty. Oh my gosh, it's doing the right thing. <gasps> Yes! Guys, this is a huge moment. Oh my gosh, it actually looks so freaking pretty. I actually did it. Okay, now I'm just gonna go in. Here I go. Okay, it says do this and then you're going to Take away the excess nail polish in the water. Uh, oh my gosh, official beauty guru. <laughs> now it says bring it out of the water slowly. Oh, guys, it's so pretty. So now we're going to peel off the pink part. This is gonna be so satisfying, wait. Oh. My gosh. <gasps> and 
and obviously I need to like clean it up a little bit, but guys, that's so pretty. I'm just gonna do the same thing again. I'm going to go in with the pink, the red. So you're not going to go all the way from the outside because the outside has already started to dry. So you're going to want to go from halfway. That looks crazy. Oh my gosh. So these are the two nails that I have so far. I think that they look super cool. This is honestly turning out so much better than I thought it would. And I'm very, very happy. I think that the colors complement each other very well. And I just think that it's really pretty. So let's continue. Guys, honestly, this is so much fun. I'm gonna be doing this so much more in my free time. I'm like obsessed with it now. Guys, I feel like a freaking professional and I'm not at all. This is so freaking cool. If this continues to go well, this literally looks like I went into a professional nail salon and got a really pretty manicure. So now time to dip in the pinky. <laughs> and voila! This is my favorite one so far. It looks so freaking cool. Guys, that's so pretty. Okay, so I just finished this hand. I'm gonna move on to the other. I am honestly so in love with how these look. They all look so uniquely different and the colors just look so pretty together. I'm just so obsessed. I'm gonna be doing this so often now. Okay guys, so I just finished my nails. They look so freaking cool. I still have like some paint on my fingers and stuff, so I'm just gonna take some acetone and wipe all of that off and then I will come back to you guys and we will see the final look when I put the top coat on. Okay, so I just finished cleaning everything up now I'm gonna put on the top coat. I am honestly so obsessed with how they turned out. I think that they look so pretty and they're all so different and the colors just look so nice. So this is the finished look. I am honestly so obsessed with how they turned out. It looks so gorgeous. Huge shout out to Sally Beauty. You guys are amazing. All the products that I use today are from Sally Beauty. If you guys want to check them out, they will be in the description box below. If you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know. Give this video a thumbs up and I love you guys so much and I will see you guys next week. Stay majestic.